welcome to Kachai with Lucky. We are back with some great conversations. I do have Brian Semanda, who is a sex therapist, who prides himself in that. And yeah. uh, good to see you, by the way, thank, Brian. Thank you. I hope you're well. I'm well. Okay, so the conversation we are having today is a conversation that we have been putting on, of, you know, for, for, for some time on the side. Uh, you know, when you are into the game of getting intimate with your partner, and then all of a sudden, this thing that happens and it turns you off in most cases people will give up especially when you've been enjoying and then all of a sudden the man is up now he's done he's down and then she gives up totally or he gives up totally how do you get back into the game and avoid the giving up completely because remember you're both not satisfied yet exactly you see that we should first of all address what has been what has caused it some mm -hmm. sometimes there are words the people say mm. sometimes uh, okay ladies actually have this thing you're ready somewhere close and someone changes the rhythm and you're like oh god and you go to and you back to zero and you're like okay finish up and go uh -huh. uh, and then also guys because women think sometimes that for us we don't have emotions mm. sometimes uh, someone does something go you see one thing i've, I've had there's a when a, a woman speaks to you a certain way mm. not that one <laughs> You also. She's now beginning to get irritated exactly. because you're not quite getting her. Yeah, you're irritating, you're annoying, and you're doing your own things. Ah, so in your system, usually a guy goes down. Mm. And then, so usually what you need to do is, first of all, understand why are you in here. Is it your partner or someone who's just sexually satisfying? Mm -hmm. Because we need to know the basics. Because there are people I know who are in the sex for, right. for, for whatever reasons. Mm -hmm. Some have money issues, some are whatever. Power issues, oh, I just give this guy sex because he, he feeds me a home. Mm -hmm. So if I don't give him sex, there's no money. So if you're in a partnership or a relationship or marriage or stuff, this is something you need to build every other time. So I am thinking it's very key for us to know that while I am off, what caused the off? I should understand that I should separate. This is my thinking meanwhile, mm -hmm. on my beach, sorry. Mm -hmm. I separate this guy from mm. up here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Whatever you say, if me I want, I still want. Mm -hmm. I have tried to make, make myself that way. You're mentally ready to 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 to, to be in this uh, because, because sometimes yeah. we go into it. Uh, you, uh, let me interested. just do. Let me just he do. He wants, but, but, I want. Yeah. But the turn offs and ons. It's key for you to understand that the create the creativity of us men always is what gives up on us. Mm -hmm. There are men who entirely depend on their guy. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I keep on telling men, never depend on the guy because the guy can give up anytime based on whatever situation there is. So I tell people, if this guy goes down, what are you going to do? What are you bringing what's to the table? Move? What's your next move? As this guy prepares to get back Exactly. Up, if he can get back If, if he can. Mm -hmm. Because I will say, uh, sometimes you're d doing your car one round that takes you like uh, five minutes, but you have to wait for two hours. Mm -hmm. And then by the time you wait for two hours, the other girl has even given up. Right, <laughs> she right. has slipped off. Mm -hmm. So this is what you do. Create an environment where it's going to be, create a story. Right. Your it's called a bedroom story. Good. Like how you have a baby girl home and you read them stories before they go to bed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And there are kids who never go to bed before you read the stories. Right. So in the event that guy has given up, see this woman, this body of a woman is such magical that if you study it, even just touching a certain place mm. can connect a keeper in the move. Their system has, is made to last longer depending on what you're doing. Because mm. some women go like, ah, me, I can even go two hours depending on what you're doing. Mm. People can irritate you in 30 minutes and you're like, when are they stopping because of what they're doing? Mm. So if this guy gives up on you, the body, study the body. Because right. like everyone is special. And I keep on telling this, everyone is special. So when this guy gives up on you, mm. imagine if it, usually if this guy gives on you, even the other girl has given up. Right. You know why? Mm. Because women also don't like the idea of looking at a guy. Mm. And this is a trick that I can tell the guy because mm -hmm. I am on the receiving side mm -hmm. and I probably know what is going on. Yes. So in most cases, when you're actually going down, that motion of completely going down, you feel it. Yeah. You feel it before it happens. So why are you waiting for it to go completely down before you actually change? If you sense that for whatever reason, maybe it's what I'm doing, maybe it's what you're not doing, your money starting slowly to shrink and go back to the original position and it's hard for you to keep that, uh, that place hard, what you can do is do other things. Now, yeah. it's also Chiveko. And before the transitioning is where the problem is Problems because are. people fail to transition from oh, going down to actually getting back there, and we both get frustrated. So, before he goes back down, find things that she enjoys. Maybe if she likes going down, 
You go downtown. Go away now. Choose that moment to maybe kiss her on the cheek and then slowly because caress her and then go down. That man also will be recharging. Because this guy, the more you put him on pressure, the, the more he goes down. Exactly. But ignore him. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I, this is what I tell a lot of people, many young people that come for consultations. Right. So ignore this guy. Let mm. him be the last thing on your mind. Mm, mm. As you're doing other because this guy has a way of also feeling pressured. Like, the way you feel pressure, you put a lot of pressure on him and mm. that he can't even get up. You try to push him harder. And meanwhile, what I've learned over time, if this girl is really wet enough, mm -hmm. you see, when you're being sexually engaged, this guy doesn't go completely back to its original state. Mm -hmm. Stays in that car mood. Mm -hmm. So when you grab him and learn to move him a certain way, because this girl, remember, mm -hmm. I said last time, when you mm -hmm. whisper into her, don't be going direct on her. The process right. of you moving, whatever moving you, the clam shaking, mm -hmm. the other movement is going to be communicating. Mm -hmm. The problem is the pattern or the rhythm you're doing in it's there. It's got to be different. Because the more you force it, the more it gets irritated. Just mm -hmm do your little movement mm. because the other person receiving from you mainly the woman mm. in this case mm. majorly a woman mm. in this case should always be ready to receive something so the consistency of you doing something because women mm. sometimes when you're doing this and then you change she, she goes up yeah, yeah because she's the thing i'll just explain that the thing is when you over move <laughs> As she's trying to get there, uh -huh. now you move away from that position. Exactly. It kind of takes us back. Mm -hmm. So this whole <laughs> fidgeting. Is it's it? Not is a good it? Thing. Is it? Is this pattern of uh, uh, okay explored? Mm -hmm. uh, a friend of mine said, uh, "You know, you know, when you get that girl and just be putting her apart, put, put her together mm -hmm. in the process of just playing with her, gets back to the rhythm. You're like, wait, mm -hmm. something nice is happening to me because that girl has no one movement. Mm -hmm. Like the science of the vajaja is magical. That if you just start blowing on it." Mm -hmm. Like consistently do something small because every time you depend on one mm -hmm. thing, mm -hmm. and, and and at the end at the end of the day, watch what a woman does because if you watch what she does, you will see either she's enjoying or she's tired. Or she's off. not, which which I was going to tell you. By <laughs> exactly. The way, because you might want to blow and she's not really into exactly. It. So you must be key. Uh huh. Even the conversations you have with us, mm -hmm. some of your conversations are total turn off. Because there are men who will say, oh, when I'm with her, when we're starting off, she's so well, and you know, she, I'm enjoying, everything is just right. And then all of a sudden, it just goes dry. Goes down. That means she's just completely out of it. Waiting yes, for you got you to her go. into the mood, but now you're starting to do things that she doesn't understand. are getting her off. What are you saying to me? Exactly. Some of you go there because you've spoken to some other girls and they've said they like it. They give it to me. Eh, eh. And then... <laughs> And you're like a horse. <laughs> Make you know it. It's like you're commanding. You see, it just turns you off. So study your partner. You see, what, I, what I've learned, like that girl loves consistency. Right. Because this guy keeps on fluctuating. Mm -hmm. So when you find a place where this guy has gone up, I told people the only master in here is the finger. But the problem with the finger guy is people don't know how to move the finger. Mm -hmm. You don't be looking for gold. Mm -hmm. You see, the consistency of your pattern. Mm -hmm. Just be, mm -hmm. even though these fingers, if, if you put them in, mm -hmm. and just... No and just things. play with them. Yeah, simple play. things. Mm. Simple things. Mm. But most of pe most most people say, Brian, the guy can be in you and you feel like you're as old. if he's digging. As <laughs> if he's digging and you feel like so the issue is that girl, because she's very sensitive, uh, uh, the way you put your fingers or uh, finger, uh, it's supposed to be a place where you as if you're you're with gold, it's about to break. But Brian, not every woman loves exactly. those fingers. That, that's what there. I'm saying. It discover. Is, uh -huh. discover. discover if your woman wants those fingers. Because some some women uh, you know, we have so many things going on. Uh -huh. Sometimes you're thinking their finger, well, been, you know, like exactly. you're tormented by just the fact that he's there because you know fingers, you know, touch left, right, and center. For some women, they don't really like it. So it's important to study a woman. If if the fingers work for her, go for the wing of fingers. Some people conversations and yeah. those whispers and whatever they get Bedroom them back stories. into the system. So once you feel that she's starting to get agitated by the motion, by everything, you're doing everything wrong as far as your man, your your, your man is concerned. Then you need to now recover, recovering. Effect. Start whispering, start finding those little things you that see, you don't get into I, that I keep place. on telling people, don't be too serious, like mm. your headmaster of the school. Eh? <laughs> like everything is about the rules. Right. <clears throat> just, just be playful. Like forget about the story. Change, change environments. Meanwhile, it's mm. okay to change environment. Right. But if in the same bed every time, the turns over that you're like, oh, now it's it's crazy. Commun communicate. It's just cut once and start speaking. This guy is going to get up again mm. because most people think when this guy and a lot of men actually only wait when the guy is up they attack. Uh huh. Uh huh. And when the guy is up and you attack, you're not going to be patient enough to wait for the girl to get there. Right. And and lots of women, if you are, she's turned off. Mm. Get back to the place where she's happy. 
Because if you sometimes even the silence matters. Mm. Silence and movement. Just hold her and I start moving. And have other conversations. Yeah, as, 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 before, you you know, before you know you see women I have learned that women love love the praise and the praise, for them the the the, 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 the girl the, the in the girl, middle the of the cooking. the girl up here mm -hmm. respond determines whatever happens to the girl right, this time. Right. Because if you master the girl up here, the girl up here must be praised all the time. Mm -hmm. Must be put in a place where she feels like she's the own, only mm -hmm. thing. In the event that the turn off is being caused mm -hmm. by you to her or whatever she said and on you overreact because most men also have Ntondo, they have mm, that and, and uh, someone says something different and you overthink about it. Where have mm, you been? Mm, mm. When a woman tells you to do something, it doesn't mean that that she's been somewhere else. Most yeah. women, actually, most women fear telling people what to do. Mm. Uh, let him do whatever he does because when I mention, he thinks I've cheated. Right. Women read a lot meanwhile. Mm. It's okay to communicate your feelings, but how you communicate it? You see, most men don't like being verbal. Mm. Like you to be verbal about what you want to be done to you. Right. So that means as a man, you must be in charge. Mm. When you see her do something, Follow it. Because most of you, don't wait for God to... Don't do that. Mm -hmm. Do it this way. When you speak to a man, most times it feels like, eh, I am a baby now. Mm -hmm. But just direct in a certain way. Like, or gestures you use to, mm -hmm. to, to mean what you want. Because as a friend of mine, I, I was telling me, Brian, the, guys, the girl said... Guy. Like it, it just skipped her <laughs> man. Yeah. And, and the, which guy? No, I was just watching a movie. And of course the story was like awful uh, because you compared somebody to someone. Mm. But the key element here is women should avoid being verbal about what to do because you can make a mistake. It's very easy for you to make a because mistake. Because the tonation also changes yeah. depending on how um, because sometimes it's frustration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're expecting him to bring his A game and maybe that time he didn't get it, and that's the time you actually wanted him to be a hundred percent. So when you speak, whatever you're feeling inside is going to come out and the tonation is not going it's to gonna be right for your guy. That's but here's <laughs> what I, I, I know, Brian. There's something about connection that is a turn on for almost everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And connection is eye contact. Eye contact always <clears throat> works wonders. I do not know. Some people will say I'm closing my eye. You can't even look at that. <laughs> <laughs> like, like throughout the kissing he was closing the sex he was boom, enjoying and closing their eyes but then the woman is trying to talk to you because once you have eye contact you see the one the you see the themes. passion there's unsaid things you will see when you're, you're, you're making the right move when you're making the wrong move so when you start to slip off the game or she starts to slip off the game how about you have conversations looking straight in her eyes uh, you, see, yeah. you see the conversations come also place uh, you see Sex is about passion, mm -hmm. intention, and, and, and all, you, you, you must be here. Mm -hmm. And I Completely. Tell, if you're not going to be giving it your all 100%, please don't do Perhaps it. Perhaps you shouldn't. You shouldn't. Yeah. It's supposed to be taking your all, be present, and mm -hmm. when you're present, certain unsaid words, you can feel them. Because right. when a woman, you look at a woman directly, mm -hmm. you hear her movement. And mm -hmm. even just, you see, what turns, off, turns men on most times is not what they see, it's what they imagine. Mm -hmm. So when, when, when she sees you, yeah. You're doing whatever you're doing, mm. the connection begins to grow, and the bro and I, I like the body heat that comes up over time. Mm. Because women, when they get that horn over mm. time, their body becomes like really, really hot. Mm. So if you're in the kind of positioning, so you don't want to see a woman looking at you as if you're Bambi, you're trying, mm. Bambi is trying, <laughs> in the place where you feel like I, I, I'm weakened. Okay. Just put the A game in conversational mm -hmm. growth. You see, most women, I've, I've, I've actually learned over a time that as women grow older, mm. or when you stay with someone over a time, right. you, they know they ex expect certain things. They mm. know mm. what's going to happen. Either you'll come in 10 minutes or you're not going to come. Uh -huh. So the issue is because they know the pattern, you're yeah. going to engage them a way that is beyond what you're doing. Mm. Because uh, uh, sexuality and turn-offs, uh, to me, is not what you do, is not what you say, but the intention behind it, because people over imagine. There's a, a, a guy friend who told me once, man, I was with this girl, but her facial expressions just turned me off. You know, like, you could clearly <laughs> see Tachirimo. Tachirimo, of course. And it shows. Like, there's that lazy look, like, oh, uh, when you're done, please get off me. That kind of... so. Facial expression can also determine how a man may feel down there. Automatic. Because men don't really want to make, they don't want to feel like they're not doing anything. You know? And normally you can tell by the facial expression. I've told women before, uh, if you can't fake it, fake the damn facial expression, be in a movie. Show him the face that you have on, should be like, wow, Let you are amazing. <laughs> That's how people end up faking because when we go into oh. this thing uh, into having you know intercourse with your partner in most cases sometimes you don't do it for us see that's love 
Exactly. If I feel like you, Brian, are into it at this moment, even if I'm not, I'm going to act do something. Along. I'll do something. So if I'm doing the round for you, ah, I'll be, be, the, I'll be, be an magical. actress. But, but the, be an, I'll be an actress. <laughs> when you act, it's just you, the moment you start acting it, guess what? There's ha- someone who will catch you from there. Uh-huh. Like you see, you see, I, I've seen, I've seen these things. Women say, when a guy is trying to force me sexually, I don't know what to do. Like if you, if you don't want him to force you, die. Like be dead. Automatically, this guy is gonna give up. Uh, uh, if you die and right. just be dead. There is a saying, fake it until, until you, do you it, make it. Until you make it. Faking it puts you in that. This, this is why people have ultra egos. Do you know? This is lucky, Mbabazi. But when I'm in that moment, I can be anything I want to be. I well, can be Sasha. Th- these stories of faking it to be a ratchet woman. <laughs> th- this is what happens. I've had a lot of men complain about the woman at home, but I have this girl at, at, in town is like, she, she, she says I have no manpower. You see? Mm-hmm. But the other girl, I don't know, me, I get energy. Simply because the other girl is doing certain extra things, things. Extra things. Even when she's not feeling it, she's feeling it. Uh-huh. And this is what I've learned over women. Women, sometimes they imagine this guy is going to get you wet. Mm. Sometimes they may not get you wet. Yeah, you know you can get yourself wet also? Of course, it starts here. It starts here. And when it, the, the, the body movements you can do as a woman to get this girl ready quickly. Mm. If you kept on kiggling him and mm. uh, pushing out, the girl gets down there heavily. Mm. And this man feels you in the process. Mm. So the key element because sex is passion, sex is intention, sex is everything. So when you're not doing it for your purpose, it's okay to also relax, lay back, and let him fall and be into a sleeping mode mm. of like you're yeah, there, you're, 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 you're in between. There. The, you see the hibernation, you're like yeah. in a trance of sorts. It also makes movement, but also the trance may depend. A guy is here, flip, mm-hmm. changing you all the time. Uh, first change. Speaking, <laughs> speaking about flipping, there's a friend of mine who told me, Banali, I was with this with this guy, and do you know what happened? In the middle of it all, he farted. <laughs> <laughs> so farting is like a tunnel. Very for much her, so. The thing was smelling, so he turned her off. She's like, I didn't even know how to come back from that. The guy kept on going, going, going. But now he's saying, I'm going. All of a sudden, she was dry. So when something like farting happens, to, yeah, see, you, to, you, you can't fake there. It's really. No, no, no. It's really happening. But you know what happens? Once you're already in that zone, trust me, you won't smell the fart. Oh, when you're also part of the story. When you're part of the story. See, you gotta go I mean, in. Yeah. Thing, meanwhile, uh-huh. It's a fun one. You make fun of it. The story, the story is when you keep on flipping mm. and flipping and flipping because let this girl enjoy certain positions. Right. When you're the one flipping, sometimes you're flipping at a place where she was almost there. Mm. And one thing I've learned about the VJJ, when it is in a zone mm. and there are certain things you have to maintain. If right. it's just a slow motion, if it's you just maintain that, that, maintain that. Yeah. because this is what I've, I've learned about it. There is nothing that works for it. Everything can work for it depending on the consistency and how you're doing it. Mm-hmm. Because mm-hmm. at the end of the day, all we end, we, we are minding about is fun. And you, a girl who is in part, don't wait for this guy to, guy to make you come. You see, it's fun when you also commit to it. Mm-hmm. Commitment mm-hmm. is key. Me, I don't, if I realize your energy is not flowing with me, sometimes I don't even waste my time. Mm-hmm. But it's supposed to be a want thing. There are things women do that will make any man crazy. Mm-hmm. If you move your, whatever legs you move in te- without being without pushed, being, yeah. it feels good as well. Because most things as men, for us men, we just see. Mm-hmm. When we see, things go up mm. but this is what you need to understand if the reason why your guy is going down is not for a turn off it is your met your nature it's a different mm. story mm. because there are people who say brian sometimes before i even enter uh, i've already gone down i've already gone down mm. and uh, sometimes i'm in the middle of the action i have the energy all of a sudden a guy slips off then i guess those those need a little more patience because yeah. they are on and off they are on and off it's also very agitating for the woman for the woman have, yeah, yeah. Uh, because this guy said Sometimes if I even enter, I get excited, and, and before I enter, I, 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 I come. So this is when you realize that because your your mind has taken up the whole idea. This was it. Don't take it too serious. Mm. Be playful. Mm. You see, the playful bit is what makes this girl continue staying on this guy. Every time you push pressure on them, mm. this is why you have to understand that. If you want to master the, the girl downstairs, use everything else and forget this. This should be just a icing on the top of the thing. Because if you concentrate on the guy downstairs, you need extra energy and extra control and extra practice. Mm. Because this guy practices. You see, when you are in the place where, for example, the uncircumcised men, mm-hmm. sometimes you get easily excited. And there are people who are also circumcised, but because their muscles are weak, because of the things they've been going through, mm-hmm. they will also do. Because there's a lot more science and health to it than just the 
the, sometimes the, you're on a certain medication exactly. for, for a while. Maybe so, you've had it's by the way, it's simple medication. It could be malaria medication, yeah, it could be an antibiotics, and then you're it, not your you say, you see, in this kind of season, for example, there's disease, you have a, 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 a corona, you have a cold uh -huh, forever. Uh -huh. Every antibiotic has a way of stressing your body and when your body is stressed as a man your testosterone production lowers mm -hmm. and when it lowers that means this guy is not going to function the way you want mm -hmm. it could be a pressure of any sort school fees coming in and all that so this is when you need to realize that 90 percent to women sex is not the guy downstairs it's psychological it's psychological it's everything. so every engagement you do to that missy down mm. there trust me it's going to work out mm. and, I, and I, I don't mind being a bitch sometimes mm. when you have gadgets to involve mm. because sex is about passion and how you do it right. whatever you use to get there should never be the point because I, this, this friend of mine told me, man, the guy put his knee and I sat on the knee. Mm. Man, I don't know what happened, but I felt like it's a new thing altogether. <laughs> like she, it, because it just put it, his yeah, knee yeah. because she's part of the story. And then she was rubbing herself on the knee. I don't and know, she did. Sometimes he also doesn't know that that worked. <laughs> yeah, because creativity becomes the key. Mm -hmm. So this is what you, what you need to do. It, whatever failures you have in the sex game, mm -hmm. it can happen. Mm -hmm. But be creative enough to know that, like... It can happen. But then if you want to continue, withdraw a little bit. Tactical withdrawal is also okay. You know, tactical withdrawal helps you gain quicker because most men put themselves under pressure. I've had people, you see, I don't have enough sex. I'm like, how long do you go? He yeah. says 30 minutes. I'm like, what? What are you doing? You know, 30 minutes is too long. Yeah. Brother, you need 10 minutes to get a girl. I said, are you sure? Yes. So, so the issue is not about how long you do. Mm -hmm. The issue is what she got, the, the game, the quality. Because people are so drawn into the quantity. Oh, I lasted one hour. I'm like, <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what are you can, doing in you one hour? You can last two hours if you're into the old fun, the tactical but you know, withdrawal. But two hours is with a break. To exactly. be honest with you, two hours is just a hell of a You time. can be nice and it's in there and you're just talking. Hey. There's no movement. But if you all... Uh -huh. There's that two hours of cuddle thing is in and, and you're just you're, talking. you're talking about the whole, you know, let's cuddle, let's have a conversation. But, but when it's in there... But the actual act, two hours of for a mood. That's the key thing. So mm. people are, people have pressures. Mm. So when you put yourself... Uh, the woman tells me uh, this guy is doing for two hours. Like, okay, two hours. What was he doing <laughs> in the two hours? Because nobody can be two hours unless you're sick or you're doing something else. Mm. So the natural aspect is... Sex is not when the guy is in there. Sex is everything. The conversation, the kissing, the cuddling. So engage the body much more than this girl. Yes. The whole idea is not worrying about what has turned you off. Turning you off in that moment does not necessarily mean the act should end there without satisfaction. Getting That's back into the game is key. Will, need, will need a lot of you know conversation, will need a lot of connect which you can still get even if the guy has gone down, even if someone has parted. It's, it's supposed gone. to be a fun thing. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, that's what we had for you. Brian has so much to say. <laughs> On Kachai oh with God. Lucky. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Kachai with Lucky, and be part of the family. God bless you. Kwaheri.